But in true Jamaica, I, uh, I, uh, I really believe that we need to militarize a few of our schools. A few of our schools across Jamaica. And particularly those schools that are said to be failing schools. And a lot of the students can't matriculate to get um, CXCs and GCEs and all of those things. Put students. I know that I am not the brightest. But one thing I believe I am is solutions oriented. I am saying tonight, students. For all of those schools that are not. Take, for instance, Grangeville. With all of the violence that is happening at Grangeville High School. Now turn that in a one Grangeville military. Hey, Jamaica. And me alone, I wonder how the mother now alarm ball. You heard what the boy killer kill you for? A phone that is said to be stolen and some money. Hmm. Wanna say the, the death no the death no hit the mother yet. The mother still in why? Look pa Akira, look pa the boy with stabber, see him there. Mm -mm. Jamaica. My God said it's stone. My God said it's stone, Jamaica. My God said it's stone. I hear Councillor Mario Mitchell saying, "I'm wondering if the 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 vaccination has anything to do with the with the the children behaving the way in which they're behaving." You know, why am I so saddened by this news? Why I'm so saddened by the news, Jamaica, is that these students are not, these students are not 13, 14, 15 year olds. These students are in sixth form program who I believe are at a higher level at reasoning or or they're at a higher level of thinking and when they're at that higher level of thinking you would have expected that in case of a dispute they would be able to argue it out without becoming physical i want to say that again At their level, Jamaica, being at the sixth form level, you would have expected that they would be able to reason out things without becoming physical. And when I say that, Jamaica, I'm saddened by the reality. Saddened by the reality, Jamaica, that so many of our children, so many of our young adults, so many of our pre-adults don't know how to reason out things without becoming physical. And to know he took up, he went to the canteen, took up a knife and went back into the classroom to stab Achille. And I honestly don't believe it's Achilles who stole the phone, you know. 
Here is how I believe it, God. I believe it's Achilles' phone that got stolen and she's of the view. That is him stealing it and him getting rage and then respond like that. I better say so, I go. I better say it's Achilles' phone go missing. And Achilles look and says, you take my phone. And the oh. argument start. And he might defend himself and get as so the get as so them as Lord Jesus. Students, only know all the bully and the aggressor them behave, you know. But I would have want to know how him reach the canteen for take up the knife in the canteen. Who in the canteen? Who in the canteen knife him take up? I saw the canteen accessible for the knife just take up for go back a class for stab. Lord Jesus. Ask what kind of thing them infuse in a, them says to the, the children them a get Mali. I don't know them say the vendors them a sell them Mali. And then students, the way in which him probably stab her, him probably out of aggression, boom. One stab. Him. One stab. Kill the poor people, then pick me. And the youth are defending in third round, tap the next youth to me, me love. Wicked boy. That's why when me see them, they pan road and I go on. Me will say, aye, aye, but me now party. You know that you can do? You can't go on there. Hmm. Somebody said it's sugary substance. I don't know what caused this. I don't know what caused these students, but when I think about it and where we are as a society, me so like a old basin, a old basin so. I can sound like a old bass and I can sound like the finest of finest silver linings you have in your house. But if you take me sound like old bass and go on and leave me alone, no man. A lot of them smoking the ganja. A lot of them depend on the marijuana and them a listen to the old heap influence of the music and I take the Mali. Students, in a one day, so much picnic dead in the country. In a one day, I know them as a little 15 year old who died. He missed the child, he missed the one child of a police officer and a student. The 15 year old who died, I gather that he's the only child for a police officer. You know how you feel, say, so you one see dead? Only hear the students. Only hear them. And when them done, them say crime down. And them attack up all on the soldier and police and send them go at 80. Rather than them do some interventions in the schools. Rather than we do some intervention in our schools. We take up ourselves and go fix EAT and a fix this and a fix that is a discussion we need to have Jamaica I said it before and I'm going to say it again I said last year and I'm going to say it again had I been in the office of the Ministry of Education I would have reinforced or used soldiers as a means in our schools we need to put the soldiers in the schools rather than put the soldier them there at Tivoli and Dungarima. Send the soldiers in at the schools to do the intervention programs. Send the soldiers in our schools. Send the police officers in our schools. Let the schools become an institution let the schools become a playground where the police and the soldier 
Oh, Jesus. And every time I talk Jamaica, only time I say soldier can't go in a school. But if we are sending the soldier them, down at the valley, down your so down there, so we not get no result. Send them into the school. If them want to militarize this state, remember, say Al Andrew Olness do is militarize this state. I better on to militarize the school them. Militarize the school them. I go and say that again. Rather than you spend time in this country militarizing the state, militarize the school so that the children them can learn the right ways. From them are coming at the institution then. But no. Human rights are say you can send them in a school. This I tell you say you can send them yes so. But when Jamaica we are going to get it right. CDA and CFSPA. All of them are going to tell you say. But you see students. Unna see where I go on now. Them are pitney and bad damn bad. And through them know about human rights and them know this and them know that. Oh, mighty God. I feel it for the country. Students, if you, you not believe we can put in the soldier. Tell Damien Crawford and tell the PNP. Should they make up the government? Militarize the school then. All of them troubled school day. All of who are troubled people in this country. Militarize the school them. It sound harsh, but if you not do something, students, them not going to get worse. And if they not get worse, them are going to get worse, Sarah. Yeah, yeah, what me say to you tonight? If them not get worse, put this in a, this, this something there. Them are going to get worse, Sarah. 